Hello everybody, Friday morning. Sadly, this is the last of this series. I've enjoyed being with you. I remember a very dramatic Saturday morning in my childhood when I and my brothers and my father went out on a tug into Table Bay. Uh, we were friendly with George Young, the shipping correspondent, correspondent of the Cape Times, and he invited us to join this tug. It may have even have been the Volrad Voltamada, famous old tug of, of, of Cape Town. And uh, we went out to lead a ship into Duncan Dock. Now, from those days, and even earlier than those days, that Saturday morning, I, I remember the, the, the old song we used to sing in Sunday school as, as, as Little East. Do you want a pilot? Signal then to Jesus. Do you want a pilot? Bid him come on board, for he will safely guide across the ocean wide until you reach at last the heavenly harbor. Remember that one? I'm sure a good many of you do remember it. Now, in many of the gospel stories, we, we find Jesus and the disciples in boats in the, on the Sea of Galilee. And one of the spiritual lessons that we're supposed to learn, and I hope we do, is that our lives are like little boats. And here we are trying to man this boat and do the best we can as we journey through life. And it's not all plain sailing. We know that. There are ups and downs, uh, many storms that we have to face. And one of the wonderful things about being a Christian is that we have the Lord Jesus Christ, our captain, on board. And he is with us, leading us and guiding us until eventually, and it comes to all of us, till eventually we cross into the great heavenly harbor. Hence that song, do you want a pilot? Signal then to Jesus. Do you want a pilot? Bid him come aboard, for he will safely guide across the ocean wide until we reach at last the heavenly harbor. For me, it is one of the treasures of being here at this harbor is to think about God and to think about my faith, to enjoy the beauty and the freshness of everything around us. But today, just that thought that I want you to consider, to invite Jesus as your captain to lead you through life and towards and into the great and wonderful heavenly harbor.